If ignorance is bliss, why should we seek knowledge? Akanchi. I think that all of the questions that you're posing today have two different sides, and it really depends on the kind of perspective that you have. If you take me, I'm someone who cannot ignore things. I need to know, like I have that hunger. So for me, ignorance is not bliss. In fact, I am calmer when I have all of the knowledge and then I can sit and ponder over it as to what my opinion about something would be. And there are other people who would find ignorance to be bliss because simply because either they cannot handle what the real truth would be or they don't care or um, they will simply not understand some of it. So if, I don't think that there is a black and white answer to your question that whether ignorance is bliss or whether we should acquire knowledge. I think that it would be depending, dependent on the person who is faced with a particular circumstance and has to decide whether they want to know more or just choose to ignore it and move on. In my case, when, um, Let's see, the coronavirus, when it came up, I could not simply ignore the several aspects of it just because different parts of my brain were getting activated about, okay, what's gonna happen to my family back in India? Okay, what do I need to do uh, to stay safe? How can I help out the community by doing my part? And I would want to know every single thing. But when it comes to my younger brother, who is in India right now, he absolutely does not care. <laughs> he's just going to sit at home and watch Netflix and enjoy. And he doesn't care as to what he's going to like, what he has to do and what, how he can help out or whatever. So for that kind of a person, ignorance would be bliss. For me, I would always seek to acquire the said knowledge. Thank you.